Shalom. Shalom. Call a lawyer by Yahweh, by Hashem, Yahweh Shai, by Hashem, Chachodash. Go on us to the apostles and the elders, a great millstone who rule well. Shalom. Mahasad. Lahabachayar. Peace and mercy to the elect. Your fellow servant, them Yad Yah, represent the GMS Church in Cleveland back in the spirit. Hope and I pray this had a fine lesson. <clears throat> Yeah, so I was on the freeway and I seen this Hellcat right here. That's, it, that's what it is. And then he went in front of me and his license plate said, you see it, it say work for it. That's the problem with you jakes, man. Y'all niggas want to work for cars. Y'all don't want to work for the fucking, excuse me, excuse me. Y'all don't work for the for the, for the blessed kingdom of Yahweh Bar Shibi Yahweh Shai. Which we heirs to the kingdom of the heavenly father. You, which your heir is somebody who have a, a, a portion in someone's inheritance, man. So Yahweh Shai, the son of the heavenly father, Yahweh, he inherited. You know, this is his inheritance, man. And he gave us a portion as a, you know, a beautiful big brother he is to us. And Lord, he's our Lord and Savior, and he's also our big brother, man. I don't have a problem with that. To hell with you niggas who do got a problem with it. Work for it. That's what he said. Work for it. Which we got to we gotta work for it in this truth. Because, cause right, the Lord spoke about the parable of, with the penny. You know? All right? Which the, 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 we got to put in work. We got to labor. We can't be idle. But going to these jakes, they rather work for a hellcat that the heavenly father is going to burn up with thermonuclear destruction real soon. How do we know real soon? Because the particular prophecies that's being manifest, Israel, Iran, over there, the dragons of Arabia, particular prophecies are being manifest in the planet Earth. That's how we know. Those are the those are the indications that the Heavenly Father left. And in, in what? In the in the records, the holy scriptures, man. So yeah. Which which yeah, you gotta work for it. Yeah, like you if you want something in this society, you do have to work for it. You know? But, but but the difference between us and two-thirds of our people, we're not trying to work towards gaining anything in this society. We cool with our daily bread. They go another Hellcat. Oh, no, that's the one dude. Um, What's his name? Because I'm in Cleveland. You got the one dude. And they just park the police car for people can drive by slow, man. It ain't even no cop in there. It's a lock I'm driving. But the one dude who towed the cars, I forget his name. Uh, damn. The one dude. Everybody knowing he from Cleveland, you know. I just see him in his Hellcat or his 392, whatever he got. So that's what these days do. They work for it. Y'all don't want to work for the kingdom. <laughs> you still got to make payments on that car. Do this devil want to come and take it or niggas steal it? And that's why the Lord said, lay up your treasures in heaven. You know, where, where, where thieves can't break through and steal. And moth don't corrupt, roughly paraphrasing, man. You know, cause this a labor of love, so you gotta put in work. This is this husbandry. This a hard job. Husbandry, you know, um, tilling the ground, um, you know, planting seeds, watering it. You know, that's a that's a that's a that's a a, a hard task, man. Oh, he got a three ninety two, but this one was a Hellcat. You know, so we laboring for the penny. The, the, the penny is the kingdom. We don't want to work for no charges in Hellcat. Now, some brothers may have this. That's cool, man. And nothing wrong or wicked about having a Hellcat or a charge. If the Lord, you know, blessed you with the resources or the money to get it, you can spend your money, whatever you want to spend it on. Pursue it to the strip. Long as it ain't no wicked shit, which your car ain't wicked. You know, but these cars, these vehicles in particular, these type of vehicles, they put spirits on niggas, man. You know, niggas always want to steal them. Especially the Dodge, which the Dodge logo is wicked in itself. Well, it's not wicked, but these devils, they, they worship the animals and the creations and the stars and the moons and the quasars and, the, and every fucking thing, man. Greek mythology and Rome and all this shit, man. Um, but the Dodge um, logo, it's actually a ram. So it looked like a... a uh, it looked like a, a Baphomet, you know, with the head like a goat, and then the ram's horn. That's what. That's what. That's the. That's the logo for Dodge. And who's under Dodge? Chrysler and Jeep. So they all fall under the same category. They all worship Baal. They sons of Balayil. 
Satan. And that's why, you know, niggas be taking over, doing burnouts and everything, and it got a fucking... And then uh, just because the car make a particular type of sound, it got a... Uh, what is it? got a supercharged, whatever the fuck that shit is. And it whine. And when you driving it, people be so infatuated with that shit, man. Like I said, that shit cool. The brother, he had... Now, the 392s or the the, the, um, the Super Bs or the Super Hornets, they don't got the, the, the Supercharger in there. So, they just like V8s with, with like high uh, horsepower and shit like that. But the char the Hellcats and the and the Trackhawks and the Hellcat Durangos, they got like superchargers in them bitches. So, you hear a particular whine. Man, Jake know. So, Dodge, they worship the ram. They worship the goat, man. All right. As a matter of fact, let me see something. Right, so that's basically how the Ram um, logo look with this with this head right here. You got the body of a man and shit, you know, but the head it looked like the head of a goat. You see, so that's the logo for Ram, the head of a goat. You know, so back to this, this, this ain't work for it, but Jake don't want to work for the kingdom, man. <laughs> and with the kingdom is, it's eternal. It's everlasting. It never goes away. See these things that you're working, putting your blood, sweat and tears in this shit is going to go away. It's going to turn to, it's going to be nothing left perceived, but does the smell of smoke. Not just the people when the Lord get to zapping them with the, with the, with the lasers from the cherries. These motherfucking cars going to be dust and smell of smoke. The scripture said the elements shall melt like fervent heat, man. These cars are made out of the elements of the earth. What do you think they get the materials to manufacture and to produce these vehicles, man? At this high, at this, you know, at this high fucking high volume, you know? They get these materials from the, from the earth, man. Metal, you know, iron, um, um. And then some of this shit, they fucking just make chemicals and make this shit up, like, you know? <laughs> you know, not no natural, because you got natural uh, materials, and then you got uh, basically, like, synthetic material, like plastic and shit like that, like, you know? Um, so, yeah, man, I, I just seen this car just on the freeway, man, and I seen the license plate say it worked for it. And, and I was just thinking, man, Jake don't want to work for the Heavenly Father because y'all really work. Y'all think um, the compensation that y'all receiving from this devil is going gonna, is gonna to succeed or, or, or triumph or trump, Salaki, trump the uh, the compensation of the Heavenly Father. It can never compensate the... the, the, the um, it can never um, trump the compensation of the Heavenly Father that the Lord is going to be given to us, man. You see? Because what does the compensation of the Heavenly Father consist of? All right? Eternal life. Superpowers. Spiritual powers. Like, you got that one show, Supercell, I think it is. I was watching a couple of that. But even on that show... And I, and, I, and I think it was like all Jakes who had the power and shit. I, I think it was like all Jakes, if I'm not mistaken, right? They all had like power and some shit. But um, so that's part of the compensation of the Heavenly Father, spiritual power. All right. Um, infinite riches and wealth. Like what? If we wanted a Hellcat or a Charger, you could even make that in the kingdom, bro. Make that bitch fly or you never know, man. You know? So this was just a quick through the spirit in transit, man. I pray this was edifying. Call lawyer, man. Yahweh, Hashem, Double honors to the apostles. The elders of Great Millstone who rule well. Shalom, Wachasad, Laha, Bachayar. Peace and mercy to the elect. Shalom, Kwame Ashalom.